everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I am filming a testing products video. I will be trying Japanese and Korean products that my beautiful, beautiful wifey got me. Neho, Kristen, Neho. I'm gonna insert a photo of my beautiful wifey here. She is single. So she actually got me two Korean products and two Japanese products. The two Japanese products are candies and then the two Korean products are a face mask and a hand mask. So I'm quite excited to try this. We will try these candies. It is called Sakuma's Moomin Candy. It has like the scarecrow looking guy on it. I know he's not a scarecrow, but he looks like one. And this little girl like, I don't know if these are sour. They're in like this little can. I think she told me that the last time she ate these was when she was little. Crap, your parent needs to be like freaking Wonder Woman or something if she's gonna open this shit. Sorry. New Year's resolution, don't curse. Not nice. <laughs> I'm gonna go for a red because that's the best one always. This one's strawberry flavor. The apple, orange, grape, strawberry, lemon, and pineapple. This is just your traditional hard candy. There's nothing very special about it. This next candy that we have is chocolate, and I do love chocolate. I'm wondering if it's just like traditional chocolate, although it does look like it has white chocolate on it. My question is, why is it in the shape of a boy and a girl? Are they encouraging people to eat children? That's kind of weird. Okay, but I'm trying it. So who am I gonna eat, the boy or the girl? I think I'm gonna eat the boy, because if I eat a girl, it's kind of weird. That was not meant to come out like that. The chocolate tastes like something. I mean chocolate, obviously, but like, a kind of chocolate that I've had before. It is nice. It's good. Um, it's thicker than I expected. I expected a thin, thinner child. I'm going to be sticking it in a hot chocolate, like I said, and melting him away and eating him like that. I kind of want to say that that reminds me of like the inside of a sixlet, but I can't put my finger on if that's the exact thing I'm thinking of, but I do think it might be it. So if you like sixlets, then you'll like this. Moving on to the Korean part of the video, we are going to try two beauty products. We are going to try the Skin Food Face Mask, and it's a black sugar mask. Supposedly it promotes healthy skin, which is something that I really need because my face isn't doing its best right now. I probably should have done the hand mask first. You know what, I'm going to try it with this on my face because I need to wait for that anyways. 10 to 15 minutes. This is 15 minutes, so that's gonna be fine. I'm just, I'm gonna look like a freak of nature for a little bit. Okay. Ah! No! <laughs> this feels nice. It's like, it melts in your hands, and it's very, like, sugary. And now the internet can see me pretty much smearing poo on my face. So luxurious. I'm enjoying this. Thanks, wifey. You know, you know me too well. Oh, so cute. While we let this settle, I am going to go ahead and try this hand mask, which is called Le Mini Macaroon Jasmine Green Tea. I've never used a hand mask, so I'm quite excited to try this. And I also just want to give brownie points to my wifey, who I keep on talking about in this video because she's the bomb for getting me a macaroon hand mask because your girl loves macaroons. I'm surprised because these are actual gloves. Like, I've seen the feet one before and they're just like a sheet mask. These are actual gloves. Mmm, that smells nice. Wow, oh. Oh, oh, wow. That is one strange feeling. Like my nails get caught on them when they're going in. Now I'm just gonna sit here for 15 minutes waiting for my face and my hands and I will get back to you once it's done. I have to say I am so, so pleased with both of them. I absolutely love the smell of the hand mask. You would think that since it's macaroons it would be really sickly, but it wasn't and my hands feel so, so nice. I was actually massaging my hands through the gloves as I was doing it and I feel like that was just amazing. Would definitely redo that and I would never think that I would never think to buy a hand mask, so definitely two thumbs up for that. The face mask, it felt really good putting it on. It felt really nice taking it off. It was very easy to take off, and a lot of masks I know aren't that easy to take off. And I do feel like my face is brighter. 
I don't know if that's in my head, but I do feel like it was very brightening. First impressions, amazing. I absolutely love the two Korean products. The two Japanese products were edible. They were very good as well, but I do prefer the Korean products that I tried. If we can get this video to... I'm gonna go pretty high because I don't get this many. If we can get this video to eight likes, I will go ahead and go to the Korean store with Wifey and I will pick up a bunch of products and try them as well as snacks in different videos. So if you do want to see that, give this a thumbs up because I really, really enjoyed testing these products. And just if you want to see more videos like this, subscribe down below and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!